I think community college has been a lot more accepted in society lately and it might be due to the fact that every year top schools get harder and harder to get into. For me, community college is what saved me. Not a lot of people know this about me, but originally I did not want to go to school at all. I remember sitting at the dinner table with my parents begging me to take at least three units and I was just bawling my eyes out not wanting to. Look at this guys. Let's try the garlic noodles. Oh my gosh, they actually put a lot of garlic noodles too. Mmm, that is so good. And then this is filet mignon. And the fries here are like really crispy. After taking a semester off, I decided to take a leap of faith and sign up for college. Going back to school was the last thing I thought I would do, but here I am. I think a lot of first year community college students can agree with me that you miss uni life. Like staying at a dorm, going to parties every weekend, meeting your new best friend. But at the same time, it's crazy to think about how you're just thrown into it all at once. Being at community college feels like a great transition to adulting because of the opportunity they still provide and still being able to be at home. It is 10 o'clock guys and I woke up like at 9. Today I don't have my 10.30 class because we basically have an exam but it's just all online so we don't have to go to class. And I just finished my exam and I missed one question out of 50 ah it's okay that's still good but literally i'm getting like deja vu from my homeschooling days because i would just sit here and like do homework like i already turned off my pc but like i would just be like bah, 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 bah. i booked a yoga class um at 11 and we're about to change and go this semester, I took 20 units. I don't know how I went from not wanting to go to school to taking six classes, but I managed to stay somewhat sane by making sure to balance out life by doing hobbies and taking breaks. Hi guys, um, I just got out of class. It is currently like 4.20ish. I'm gonna watch you on a run, probably like for 20 minutes, shower, and then I have study plans with my friends. We're gonna work on UC applications. Let's go. For me, that was hanging out with friends, doing yoga, and playing badminton and pickleball. We are playing pickleball, post-school pickleball, because Thursdays is always the end of my week. And this is my first time playing pickleball in like four years. Where's Nicole? Hey. <laughs> Nicole and I used to be doubles partners in pickleball back in middle school. So we're gonna run it back. We won one out of three games, right? Four games. <laughs> it's okay. We're like still getting the hang of it. Should we split next game? You want to split? I don't know. Oh, you. like we get on and then we split, right? Yeah. Like, what, against yeah. each other? Yeah. I'm down. <laughs> Joining clubs helped me meet a lot of new people and gain opportunities that those in four-year colleges could have too. I got to meet lawyers, private investigators, the big four firms. It really allowed me to be part of the community and work on my social skills. I need to finish this book like by tonight. I think I have like 80 pages left. On top of joining clubs, I've made friends in all of my classrooms, every class I had, I always knew the people around me. We bonded over the class assignments and I wasn't afraid to ask for help. I think that's what kept me sane as well, making new friends and being closer to the ones I already had. Mm. <laughs> out of 10, out of 10, 
11. I know, always, always. Always 11 out of 10. Anyways, I'll stop talking so you guys can enjoy the rest of my finals week. Good morning, everyone. I have summer rolls with me. If you guys watched my spring roll night video, you guys would know the difference between summer rolls and spring rolls. There's like a really good summer rolls place down the street from my house. I go here, like, I used to come here a lot, but I've been so busy where like I couldn't get summer rolls here. And so now that I have time, right before my final, I decided why not just treat myself, you know? I deserve to have some summer rolls. This is the orange sauce. I have a English final at one. I am like crossing my fingers, literally praying because like English is like one of my worst subjects. Like. And I studied so hard for it yesterday with my classmates. I'm just praying for a 90, at least an 85 or something like that. Hi vlog, hi vlog, hi, hi, hi. No, 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 we gotta, we gotta lock in. Oh. oh, hey. What? Oh, hey. That's crazy. We got new smaller fries. Tasty. Demolished. We're still working on the fries. Beasted, beasted? Beasted, beasted. <laughs> Yeah, and then kind of this one. Um, uh, hey, we're working on it. Yeah, like literally, like me and Holly, like we're, we're I'm about to finish these, actually. <laughs> we're going through, we also have milkshakes too, right? Yeah, yeah, so exactly. Like, like, where's your milkshakes, huh? Yeah, you got it. Oh my it's god, it's a medium. <laughs> Show them my medium. Oh yeah, look at Holly's view. Damn. <laughs> That is half my body weight. Yeah, where's where's your you milkshake? Huh? You I've Wait, been munching you on got fries. A milkshake fries. Fries? <laughs> Wait, what are you calling me a fat ass? <laughs> like, what the fuck? He's canceled. He's canceled. <laughs> and then Andrew decides to be healthy with zucchini fries. It was not healthy. I ordered a whole fish from me. Caught in four. Yo, you good? I'm good. What is YouTube channel? Future content creator oh right there. Don't give me eating. Don't give me eating. Okay, okay. You didn't even try ours. It doesn't look good. It is good. <laughs> you can't judge a book by its cover. Like, stop it. Stop it. Like, 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 stop Last day, everyone. Last day of fall semester. This morning, I had my 8.45 exam for bio. I really need to shit because I had a latte. And even though I got it with oat milk, I really need to shit. I feel like oat milk makes me want to poop more than regular milk, guys. Like, is it just me? Anyways, we are having my last final exam on physics. I am trying to keep my 110 up. Look how pretty this campus is, guys. <laughs> Do you guys see this smile? This is the smile of getting done with 20 units in 16 weeks. Let's go, I survived. I am not mentally broken, maybe I am, who knows. But uh, so I actually ended up crying in the car like literally right after I stopped recording this because I think it was just like a relief because I didn't cry throughout the whole semester and yeah. Guys, I never understood the hype about off the shoulders until I received this package. Look at this shirt, this is so cute. Like it's like backless as well, like I need to tie it tighter but like Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. And I got um, one in red as well. And then look at these trousers. These are like low-rise trousers that I got as well. I've never owned an off-the-shoulder shirt. Like Nicole has one in gray and it looks so good on her too, but I never thought it would look good on me either because like I have pretty like broad shoulders. So I'm like, hmm, would off-the-shoulders look good on me as well? But yeah, I really, I really love this shirt, guys. Oh my gosh. 